Prescott Van Meyer, sommelier from home here with another episode. Today is a fan request. I've been inundated with requests telling me to try Four Loco. Now, to be honest with you, I thought at first they were asking me to do four crazy videos, but that's not the case. We have Four Loco right here, and we have two varieties, the watermelon and gold, which is a flavor, I guess. We have 12% alcohol on the watermelon variety, more on the end of like a Pinot Grigio, and the gold flavor has 14%, which you're gonna find with a stronger bodied wine like a Cabernet. The watermelon has this design all over it to let you know what the flavor is. There's a little bit of a Jackson Pollock going on with this can and the design. This is a loco watermelon. Certainly not those sane watermelons you hear so much about. Quite a substantial can, very hefty in the hand. There are 23.5 fluid ounces in this can, but a serving size is five fluid ounces. So you can share with your friends and pour some out for your friends who are no longer in attendance due to them being dead. Again, what really jumps out to me is the heft. Seems to weigh as much as what a gold bar this size would be. There's no indication exactly what the gold flavor means. There's probably some quality in there. And you know this is one of their premium flavors because it's not bronze, it's not silver, it's gold. So let's start with the watermelon. Now that was quite a sound. Absolutely strong indication that they were thinking of watermelon when they made this product. Certainly a lot of maltiness in this fruity beverage. Smelling the garden coming off of this Four loco. Let me wipe my chin off. Even just these sips, I'm feeling a lot of tingle in my mouth and in my heart and really my whole body. And that is what Four Loco is known for. I didn't even swallow any. <laughs> That's powerful stuff. As they say, Loco. It makes me think of somebody chewing a piece of watermelon gum and then spitting it right in my mouth. Well, let's try the gold. There is an intensity there, like someone has slammed a bunch of Smarties and cocaine together. <laughs> One of the reasons they may have called it gold is there's certainly a very strong metallic taste to it. And I've noticed the carbonation just really explodes in my mouth. So again, all those flavor profiles that I'm getting, very similar to Red Bull, but again, this has 14% alcohol, so it's really gonna get you, because I can feel it already. Now, I'm not sure exactly how many different varieties they have of these two products, but I am sure that all of them give the same experience, both of mouthfeel, the tingle that happens everywhere in your whole body. I'm feeling like I've ingested an entire Starbucks. Whole inventory. <laughs> Bean to liquid, all the way through. I wouldn't have too many of these, because um, don't know if the old ticker can take it. It's like liquid Ritalin you know, mixed with Coca-Cola and the old time Coca-Cola that had cocaine in it. Huh. Pair this with going out with all of your friends for the entire night. Ah. Mm. Wow. Really delightful. All the way through. Feeling good on that. Now it feels like my heart is just slow motion thumping. Just hard. Boom. Just feeling some slow, dark anger. Boom. I was happy after the watermelon. Now I'm, now I'm angry. And of course she wanted to divorce me. Fall in love with her personal trainer. I paid for that trainer. I did. I wrote his checks. Hey, maybe if you were drinking a Four loco, you would have had the balls to look me in the eye. Eyes. Really excited to finish these, and really excited to try the next one. Hey, join us next week for the next product because we're gonna be doing another one. I do these videos all the time, you knew that.